Hey there, this is Vanessa DeBerlay, and today I want to help you figure out what to do to start a YouTube channel. Maybe you've had all these ideas and you know you wanted to start one, but you don't know what to do to get started. Now, I'm not going to show you how to set it up and go in step by step and, and, and actually create the channel. This is the step that you need to do before you actually create the channel. You got to know what it's going to be about, right? So I'm going to go through the steps that I went through to start my second channel. I'm going to show you exactly what I did and then I'm going to show you where my channel is. I started a channel called My Amish Neighbors and I, I, I was kind of doing this as a test. I wanted to start a channel that with a topic that I was passionate about and see if it would take off. And I went through some steps to see if it was something that was viable. And as it turned out, it is. Now, it took about six months to really get off the floor, but it is viable. And I'm gonna show you exactly what I did before I started the channel, okay? What you need to do is come up with a topic. Like, what is it that I'm passionate about that I want to create a channel about and a lot of you are thinking oh nobody's gonna nobody wants to know about this because it's something that you know about and something that comes naturally to you that's when we usually think nobody else wants to know about it it's no big deal but think about it my air conditioner is out right now i have been sitting here and googling what do i need to do to check to find out so if i look sweaty that's why but um what do I need to do to fix it or to check it before I call somebody in and I found a video and he said check these five things so the point is you would think nobody would want to know about air conditioning but they do when it goes out don't they so anything can be a YouTube channel but you got to make sure somebody's going to look it up so what I did I'm going to do this now let's come up with five different topics okay and the first topic I have learn how to play the piano I just thought of these off the top of my head maybe you play the piano and you're a piano teacher and you're trying you're tired of maybe giving live piano lessons and you want to start a YouTube channel and that way after time over time these videos will be monetized and you'll be making money and you'll just videotape yourself doing different things to teach other people to play the piano and you don't have to keep doing it over and over and that is the beauty of the video so let's go ahead and click and see what i'm trying to find out i'm looking for how to learn to play the piano i wanted to make sure i said it right how to learn to how to play the piano so people are going to look that up I want to learn how to play the piano how do i learn so you click it see what videos come up are there people actually making videos like this and are they being viewed well obviously yes the number one video how to play the piano the basics piano lesson number one we're right there that tells me there's more lessons coming love it that is very clever and this video in 13 years had 27 million views so imagine this person 13 years ago created this video I don't think much has changed in how to play the piano and it's still being viewed they're making money from that over 13 years how to play the piano the second one 3 million views from three years ago so you might say well yeah but these people have millions of views how am I going to compete with that you compete with it because you're a fresh channel you're new maybe you can look at some of the different methods they have and maybe yours is different maybe you can teach children how to play the piano or teach older people how you can um, bring your niche in more to get a target to um, to, to really target um, a certain group of people so yes definitely I would make a, a, a channel on that here's another one solar system you're like wow okay what if you're a science nerd and you were just really passionate about the solar system would people look that up I don't know let's find out and I just typed in solar system so I didn't type in any individual planets meteorites comets any of that so right here solar system 101 National Geographic 19 million views in the last two years so obviously people are looking this up here's one install um well that's not we don't want that one a uh, story bots outer space planets sun moon earth this is a big one 104 million views in three years now look at this there's not a lot more here so this looks like people definitely are looking up the solar system but it doesn't look like there's a lot of competition so definitely I would start a channel about the solar system there's nine planets and you can go through so many different things about all of them all right let's try baby milestones I was trying to think you might be sitting there saying well I'm a mom and I know when I had my babies I was always looking up what are the milestones what should they be doing is my baby on track and you know as a mom we do that um now 
could care less. <laughs> I'm going to pass that. But it's just funny when you're in that mo moment, you're constantly looking it up. And right here, my baby development milestone, zero to 12 months. This one's two years old, 219,000 views, 232,000. So there are people looking this up and there's not really a lot of newer videos. Some of these are nine, seven years old, two years old, one year old. So definitely if you're making fresh videos, you definitely will probably get yourself ranked on this page and be able to make a channel just about baby milestones. Organic gardening. I know that's really big. People are getting into organic food, organic gardening, things like that. I would assume that this is really big, but I still wanted to look and see what kind of videos. These are more recent, six months, um, like 100,000 views. So no, a lot of these don't really have a million views, but they do have thousands of views. And again, you want to look at where, um, what angle these people are taking with their organic gardening. Maybe you can just focus on flowers. Maybe you can just focus on vegetables, something like that. See what's out there. See what people are watching. But again, that could be viable. Let's do another one. I have chickens, backyard chickens. I'm looking things up all the time. I'm always watching videos. And I was happy to see um, this one, he calls himself Backyard Chickens for Beginners, uh, 320,000 views. There's a million views on this one, um, 144,000. So definitely people want to know about chickens. And then you could get more, uh, you could do fun videos um, with your um, playing with your chickens, doing fun things, and then you can make it educational as well. But definitely people who are interested in getting chickens and growing them are going to look up the videos. And last but not least, I want to show you the channel that I just made. I do have a link below where I show you when this was brand new, I went through all the steps of how I put this together and I, went, I showed you exactly what I just did there. And I saw that there was interest in the Amish. I live in the Amish country in the Amish area and I'm very interested and I thought you know what that would be fun to make a channel and see it's a passion that I have I made two videos a month and within six months let me show you what happened um, go I'll go down here to the analytics it just got monetized actually two days ago so there's no money on it yet but it is monetized it has been approved um, two, yesterday got approved and three four days ago it got monetized but already it has 7,000 watch hours. If, if I were to show you just back at the, well, let me show you. In June, let me go back to June, right here, my analytics. Look what happened in just the last um, few weeks. I only had 10 subscribers that month, month, 905 views and 39 watch hours. Now look at August, okay? August isn't even over, today's the 24th, just in August. I want to show you the difference that happened in just the last few weeks. Just in August, 1,000 subscribers and almost 8,000 watch hours. You only need 4,000 hours in a year and you only need 1,000 subscribers. I did that just in August because one of the videos that I made took off and then it started generating a lot of interest. The comments are flying in. My point is, if you stick with your plan and stay within that topic, it will take off. And I, that's all I did is what I just showed you. I did a couple other things as far as um, coming up with my questions that I wanted to answer and stuff like that, but hit the link below and I go through the whole process. But that's what you need to do first before you actually physically go and create your channel. I hope that was helpful. It doesn't, don't overthink it. The worst thing that's gonna happen is you'll make a couple videos a month for a year and it will just flatten out and nothing ever happened. You haven't really lost anything. You love the topic anyway. You loved making it because it's something you're interested in. So it's not a loss and you can just leave it there. Something could happen if you decide not to make more. It's not that big of a deal. I hope this was helpful. Tell me in the comments what you think and I'll see you on the next.